do you think legislators who um, you know gain who could potentially gain um, financial or personal um, benefits from legislation should recuse themselves from bills? Okay. I think there's pretty well-defined rules on the books and laws on the books for that, which say that if you're going to directly benefit from something, you should, you should, you have to recuse yourself. Okay. So, um, do you support the alimony bill that's coming out? Uh, yes, I do. Okay. And that's from um, Representative Workman, yes, right? So, you support the alimony bill, mm -hmm. um, even though you could potentially benefit from that? Uh, listen, I mean, I've, I've got an ongoing divorce settlement that's been going on for, I'm sorry, a case that's been going on for two and a half years. Uh, you know, I haven't voted on the bill, and I, you know, I don't think that I stand this up stand to gain monetarily from that. I mean, obviously, before we take a vote like that, we'd probably talk to general counsel. But as a matter of good policy, I think it is good policy. Right, okay. So, like, if, I mean, if you could vote for it, you probably would then? I mean, listen, it's, it's a reasonable question. I'll probably chat with the House general counsel about that and kind of find out what the, what the, what the stance would be. Okay.